A showdown is brewing in the U.S. Senate over next week's Electoral College certification. NBC News now reporting that a dozen Republican senators and senators-elect are demanding a commission to audit the results of the presidential election. The group of senators says if the 10-day audit isn't granted, they will object to the Electoral College votes declaring President-elect Joe Biden the winner. This comes as a group of Michigan Republicans are joining yet another new lawsuit to overturn the election results. Grant Herms has the latest. While the lawsuit was put to rest, what seemingly will survive is the spread of the false idea that there was rampant fraud or wrongdoing in this election, which was one of the most secure in history. Michigan Republicans joining the last ditch effort to overturn the election. A group of activists calling themselves electors for President Trump signing on to a now dismissed lawsuit in Texas suing the vice president, hoping to force Pence to count their unofficial votes for President Trump. Among the activists are Marion Sheridan, a top official with the Michigan GOP, Michelle Lundgren, a former congressional candidate for the Independent Party, and Mishan Maddock, a prominent Trump campaign worker here in Michigan and wife of Milford Representative Matt Maddock. On Twitter, Maddock vowing to bring 12 buses of protesters to Washington to rally against certifying the election on Wednesday. Inside the Capitol that same day, nearly 140 Republicans from the so-called Kraken Caucus are expected to object in vain to the election results. Not a single member of that caucus from Michigan responded to questions about how they would vote. Only Congresswoman-elect Lisa McLean said in a statement she had grave concerns about the 2020 election, adding, The American people need to have confidence in our electoral system, and I will examine the facts to help ensure that is the case. This week, Democratic Senator Gary Peters called the objections to the results deliberate attempts to undermine trust in American elections. When you undermine trust uh, in, in a democracy, this is an incredibly dangerous uh, stunt that they are performing and one that should be called out. Outcry from both sides in one of the most contentious elections in American history. In Detroit, Grant Herms, Local 4.